The Purdue University Student Health Centre has recently replaced their free condom system with a points program called RightFit. The program offers a variety of safer sex materials to students for purchase. While sexual health coordinators believe that the program is a step up from the free distribution system, many students are displeased with having to pay to have safer sex. Fast Track reporter Jeffrey Webb sat down with Sam Walburn to discuss the topic further. Purdue has been cutting back all over campus. With a tighter budget, some free services that students have grown accustomed to may be phased out. One such service, offered by Purdue University Student Health Center, is the free condoms, lubricant, and dental dams. Now, students must purchase condoms from PUSH on a point system. The system is known as the Right Fit Program. Students can purchase 24 points for every $5 spent. These points are used to purchase a variety of condoms and dental dams. PUSH offers basic, ribbed, and flavored condoms for one point, larger size condoms for two points, and non-latex condoms for three points. Dental dams are the highest at four points. I sat down with Samuel Walburn, founder of AIDS Coalition to Unleash Power, or ACT UP Purdue. We discussed several issues concerning the program and the negative effects it might cause for students. Walburn opened up to reveal why he is opposed to the program and why he believes student sexual health is not the main focus of the program. I have personally um, been affected by HIV AIDS in my own life and um, started to get involved in advocating for HIV AIDS awareness and prevention. And it seems to me that this policy is so blatantly ineffective and so blatantly against the health of students um, that it really, um, it really upset me when I first heard about it. Even though PUSH no longer offers condoms for student sexual health, other organizations still do. The only place I know to find free condoms on campus, um, as well as dental dams and lubricant, is in the LGBTQ Center in Schliemann 230. And his passion for the topic wrote to the Purdue Exponent in anger, explaining why the program is inappropriate and that safer sex should not be something students have to pay for on campus. I was, I was angry and um, just, just shocked and appalled that we would take this step backward and um, wanted to do my best to rectify it um, using the techniques that I learned um, from ACT UP New York and ACT UP Paris. The spread of sexual disease is a major concern for student health. ACT UP Purdue is dedicated to increasing awareness about HIV AIDS and making sure that students are as best informed as possible. Access to preventative measures is important, but knowing what the risks are is also valuable. So we're working to create the best possible situation um, for, to have safer sex. We want to incentivize safer sex. We want people to understand what HIV AIDS is um, and really put an end to the stigma and the spread of disease. Um, we want to spread the word about HIV and not spread the virus. Reporting for Fast Track, I'm Jeffrey Webb.